And that's the whole story. So I'm just going to raise this up out of the way. It may go out of the camera angle. I'm not sure, but it'll continue to drain for a little bit. And then I'm going to get in there and stir it. Start to get a little whirlpool for those fats and hot break the troop in general, you know. There's no troop. I don't. I, guess, I shouldn't call it troop. I guess there's no hot matter at all in this kettle. Uh, I'm just really trying to cone up the fats and proteins that are coagulated. I've got a pickup tube that goes against the side of the kettle, and it uh, stops at just right at a gallon, which leaves all of this all of this uh, other matter behind. Although, you know, if you read anything or listen to anything that the philosopher has done, you know, you know that putting that matter into your beer has no impact on the flavor or clarity or anything else for that matter. Um, but you end up throwing it away one side or the other. I'd rather throw it out in the kettle than throw it out in the bottom of my fermenter. So it doesn't make any difference at all. I'm just going to let that swirl for a bit and uh, it'll settle out. And then we'll start chilling. And put it in the uh, put it in the fermenter bucket.